Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to work with UserBeyond. Firstly, you need to sign up if you haven't done it yet. Click on the sign up button here and fill in the pop-up form by typing in your username, email and password. After you finish the registration process, you will need to activate your account. Unfortunately, the activation link is quite often sent to the spam folder, so check it too. Since I'm already a registered user, I will just sign in. Great, we are in UserION now. As soon as we add our first website, a start panel with services will appear here. So let's add our first website. In the form, we type in the website's name, which is in our case Upmeter, its link, its category, which is again in our case News and Media, and the country. At the moment, the field country is not mandatory and does not affect the promotion process. But in the future, we will add a new feature that will allow to adjust the promotion process based on the country of the website's owner. So click on the Add Site button. Great, we have just added our first website. To add a new website, click on the Add New Site button here and follow the steps that we have just discussed. UserION allows us to work with several websites simultaneously at the same account. You can switch over between them using this drop down list at the top. Switching over between websites does not affect the promotion process. All websites are promoted simultaneously. Let's take a look at the main promotion services available to us. In the menu to the left, we can see two sections search ranking and smart traffic. When you will be using UserION, the number of services will probably be greater, and we will be posting videos with new services introduced in UserION. As for now, let's launch Search Ranking Promotion on Google. Click on Search Ranking and then on Google. This is a panel for promotion on Google. Each type of promotion has its unique settings of the number of page views per one visit and duration of each page view called dwell time. The total dwell time is calculated as the total number of page views and the duration of each page view in minutes. Let's set the number of page views from 2 to 3 and the duration of each page view to 2 minutes. The total dwell time will range from 4 to 6 minutes. The higher this indicator is, the greater is the probability that this website will rank higher on search engine result pages. Click on the Save button. Now let's add some keywords which will be used in the promotion. Since we promote a news and entertainment website, we need to come up with a related keyword, which in our case is viral news. Enter the keyword and click on the plus button. Great, now it's necessary to type in the number of runs in this promotion. Type in the number in the daily runs field. Here, a rough estimate of monthly runs will be displayed. Also, we can manage the promotion by pausing and launching it. Click on the play button to launch the promotion. I must say beforehand that the rates of keywords will appear in the search volume field in about 10 to 15 minutes from the beginning of the promotion. The rates are based on Ahrefs. Alright, the keyword is added and is being promoted. We can view the results by clicking on the keyword itself. As for now, the page is empty, but we can view the results that we have already achieved by switching over to another account. This panel contains statistics on the keyword promotion. We can see how the website's position on search engine result pages moves up. In the next video, we are going to discuss these statistics in more details. Thanks for watching.